Hey, what's up, YL with Crypto10x.com. I'm going to go into Masternodes in this video. So um, I'm really loving what Masternodes can offer, what they do offer. So what is a Masternode? Let's start with that. So Masternodes are a backbone to its given cryptocurrency. Um, if the cryptocurrency is implementing Masternodes, then uh, it's essential that there are uh, a few running. The more masternodes that run, uh, the stronger the network is. So masternodes enable decentralized governance, so voting and uh, whatnot inside the blockchain. They also enable new features. Um, so Dash was the first coin to uh, use and implement masternodes. Um, they used them for the sole reason of anonymity, trans uh, private transactions. So I'm not sure if most of you guys are aware, uh, some of the coins that have private features, you need to actually be in their wallet, use like dark send or you, you enable the, the privacy uh, and the anonymity and then send the transaction. So some coins you actually have to use their uh, core wallet or whatever wallet you're storing it on and make sure it's sending as a private transaction. So um, using a master node, it enables these private transactions and enables uh, instant transactions, uh, voting, uh, and a decentralized governance and um, they're different than a node that's just holding the blockchain. These are um, actively working for block rewards and they're helping um, the network and the coin. So that's basically what a gist of what a master node is. Um, what you need for a master node. So every coin is different. So Dash, you need a thousand. Pivx, ten thousand. X is five thousand. Uh, Smart Cash, ten thousand. Universal, one million. It's different for every coin. You'll also need a virtual private server, a VPS, or a server installed with Linux. I just use Volter. Very easy to use, um, and it's very easy to set up. So. Uh, you're going to need a dedicated IP address, which you do get with the VPS, and some time to set up uh, a master node. Sometimes if it's your first one, it could take an hour, maybe less. Every website, every coin uh, that offers a master node, most of the time, 99% of the time, they have other people who've done it. So they have tutorials, video tutorials or, you know, official tutorials on their website. So you can follow them very easily or you can just watch a YouTube video. Masternode ROI, so you want to know what you get paid on these masternodes. Each masternode pays out differently. Um, I'll go into some of the rewards, so you can see 1%, uh, Dash is, I believe, 7%, Pivx is around there as well. You have some masternodes going at 50%, up to 100, up to 1,000, 9,000, 20,000%. So um, the more masternodes are, there are on the network, the less the reward because you guys are splitting the block rewards. And do not just buy a masternode because of its flash ROI. You see that's uh, paying out a couple hundred thousand or a couple thousand uh, percent a year. And you buy it because of that. You want to make sure you do the research. Um, so doing the research for a masternode, it's kind of the same thing for an ICO or any other coin. You want to look at the community, the team, the demand, uh, the usage, all that stuff uh, before making a decision. Just not just looking at the numbers. So um, in the next video uh, relating to masternodes that I do, I'll go more into research and more looking more into the awards and how you know the different block awards can. Um, help you make a decision so how useful are masternodes they incentivize investors to hold the coin because you're locking those coins in a masternode so if you have a thousand or ten thousand or a million coins and it's paying you out maybe daily weekly monthly you're not going to want to sell those coins you're most likely going to just want to hold them even if it's dropping a little bit it makes up because you're getting paid uh in the same cryptocurrency so it does incentivize holding um, it creates passive income. This is the best way to create passive income, I think, with some master nodes, because not only are you getting um, the payouts, which could be uh, just a couple coins a day, but let's say you've, you've accumulated. I'm going to show you guys an example, but let's say you've accumulated these coins uh, and you bought the master node. It was a, do a dollar a coin. And now the master node is up to four dollars a coin. Not only have you forexed all uh, your original coins in the master node, but you forexed 
all your uh, your earnings as well. So that's what I'm focused on, looking for master nodes that are cheap, maybe that are down in the market cycle that I can pick up. I can, st uh, you know, they're in the accumulation phase. I can stake or set up a master node to earn rewards and I'm earning rewards for three to six months while the coin is growing in value. So I, I try not to buy anything at the top. Obviously, most people don't try to buy at the top. So looking for master nodes, you can look at masternodes.pro, masternodes.online, and bitcoin.org uh, at the announcement forum. So I'll show you guys an example of them let's go to the Bitcoin announcement forum so here you can see all coins that are being announced they will come here and you can see them first and you can check out what they're about so you'll look for coins that say master nodes 10% uh, pre-mines big let's see you see master nodes POW POS master nodes uh, Bulwark, Masternodes, this is a great coin. I think, you know, it's average. Uh, and that's an example. So I'll look for coins that say Masternode, and another one, Masternode. And then I'll try it. You see that? No, this one has 75 comments, so it's fairly new. I know Mega is a fairly new coin. I'm already familiar with it because uh, I do this process and I have researchers do this process. So they just look. As well as coins, you see a mega up here. You go to masternodes.online, you can see all the coins that are posted. You can look by change of price, volume, ROI. So let's look at the top ROI 11,600% crazy. Uh, Omega, we just saw 3,800%. Exus, 2190. I have three of these, almost on my fourth. Um, and you can see. Definitely, there's tons of options. Same with masternodes.pro, tons of options. This is paying 615% a year. You need 5,000 coins. Masternode worth is 19,000. You make 10,000 monthly and 121,000 yearly. Sounds like too good to be true just from hosting a masternode. And this is fairly cheap for Numis, $3.96. Um, I believe the price was higher. So like I said, I try to get into gray master nodes that um, have had price decreases that are in the accumulation phase. Bitcoin's in kind of an uncertain area right now, but like check that check out the graph, you see. I don't know why I'll look deeper into this. Maybe maybe it's a technology or something like that, or it's the fundamentals, but like we're at four dollars, three dollars. And it was $40. Even if we can get up to $10 just on when alts do come back, we've been staking this uh, coin at 600% a year. Even if it takes a year, you just six times your your holdings. And now when it goes to 3x, you just 3x all of that. So some pretty great gains to make. Uh, you can look from it here. Let's look at the coins. So Ignition pays the most yearly, 151k. Perfect. So there you go. You can find more coins on these websites. And I'll go into Dash. So these are the type of coins that I buy. I would say Dash is one of the more less risky, uh, least risky uh, masternode coins. Um, even though it fluctuates like this, I still think that um, it's one of the least risky ones because I know that Dash will come back to its all time high, $1,500. Uh, we're at 700 right now. We did hit 380. I couldn't get in, unfortunately. So I think, you know, if we come back down to around the $400 price, or if, you know, Bitcoin turns down and, and we we come down as a market, then I'm comfortable picking up a Dash Masternode around under $400. So, you know, if I'm dreaming, I could get in around $200. It breaks this we start into the accumulation phase or start a new, mar new market cycle and um, try and grab a Dash master node around 200 to 400K. So we'll grab the Dash master node around that price. Let's just say 400K. Actually, let's say 500K for math's sake. We grab the master node around 500K, so around this price right here. Right here. Oh, just went back up. So yeah, we get the thing around right here. A thousand coins cost us 500k. We're staking this bad boy at seven percent. Let's say it takes us half the year to get there. Not that many rewards, but you're still making seven percent. That's more than most banks give you. That's more. That's more than like an average investment. So seven percent on 500k. Six months. Six to eight months. Let's say 
maybe 12 max we're back in a full-blown market say alt season and we've pushed off this price and and maybe we're up here now so that same astro node that's worth five hundred thousand dollars is now worth 1.7 million you know and that does sound crazy but i saw i've seen dash when it's under a hundred dollars i could have bought a master node uh you know twenty thousand fifty thousand dollars and now looking at it last season last year at 1.5 million a master node you know you, you you kind of think about these things so i want to accumulate as many master nodes as possible crypto 10x is going to pool 250 uh we have about five ourselves we're looking to do poolings so if you're interested let me know we also have a master node contest where you can win a master node and be part of one of the master nodes that we are pooling together so for more videos, uh, follow our channel, subscribe, uh, comment, whatever you want to see, whatever you want to learn about. Let us know and we'll provide that value to you guys. And that's about it for today. So like I said, join the contest, join our channel, join our Discord, and I'll see you guys in the next video.